Yeah. Yeah. Three inch exhaust. Oh, nice. I, yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. Not really that loud. Interesting headliner. Did you take the cloth out and then that's just the. Uh... Yeah, that. that... Cloth thing fell down. That's the same thing happening to my grandpa's truck, so. I took it off, my sister says. <clears throat> that it looks like a, a denim or whatever. Yeah, it does. It's not that loud. Sounds good, actually. Yeah, it does. Sounds really good. I like your custom taillights and the Chevy stickers. It's a nice truck. Uh, have you got the wiring for the your towing package or no? I think it's underneath there somewhere. Okay. Four plugged in or whatever, four prong. This is a really good truck. You got the spare in there then? Yep, it's like a brand new spare. <coughs> and wheel too. Okay. Not bad, great. Bed looks nice, not rusty or bad. Yep. Nice, nice, nice. Well, I'm definitely going to share. Uh, Cheers to my friend, and might have a possible buyer. Nine hundred bucks is a good, cheap price. And yeah, that's a good price. And it's oh, a yeah. good truck. Somebody. Yeah, great. All right. I don't drive it no more. Yeah. Even got power. How about that? Yep. Power everything. Real oil pressure. Yep, got all four. No gas. No gas. Okay. So how, so does the trip meter work at least? No, that don't even work. So how do you know when you're low on gas? Gas gauge. Oh, oh, I thought you meant the gas gauge doesn't work, but it does. No, you're, yeah, gas gauge. Actually, you're just telling me. There, you're just, the you're just telling me that you're low on gas. Yeah. I thought you meant no, the gas gauge doesn't work. No, it really it works. works. That's great. Just, just not the trip. Even meter. the lights in here work, except for. This thing, I took it out Yeah. because it broke. Okay. So I took it out and it just unplugged it so the lights would stay on. But yeah. It's got all the interior lights down there. That's great. Up there. So does your speedometer work then? It's just, yeah, yep, that works. Just the odometer doesn't work? Yep, just the odometer. And the trip meter does work? No. No, so trip meter and odometer they're, both? Yeah, they're both broke. Okay. They, they were like that from the day I bought it. Huh must be something with the cluster. I don't know if this truck is so old that it's actually got a speedometer cable or if it's electronic yet. Because that truck right there for a 92 is electronic. You, you, if you're driving down the road going 60 and then you immediately shut it off, the gauges immediately stop. And I've got a 95 Ford Aspire and that car has got an actual old fashioned speedometer cable. And if I shut the car off while I'm going down the road, my speedometer still still tells me my speed. It tells you right, yeah. Yeah, so so that's yeah. that's how you tell if it's it's the electronic or an old-fashioned mechanical speedometer cable. So I bet you this is cable. Yeah, it's nice too that you got cruise control. That's always a plus. Yep, that works. That's great. If I'm backing up, the speedometer goes up. So I bet you it's got the cable. Yeah. Well, you know, if it if it had the cable, no, this wouldn't have the cable because. For instance, my Aspire that's got the cable, if I back up, it goes down. So I bet you this is electronic for an 89. Only way you know is if you take it down the road, shut it off real quick and right. see if it goes down. It's Speakers are good and everything, so. Well, it's got, like I said, that's a brand new JVC I put in there. That's I lost the remote. Not a big deal. People hardly use remotes. You got, I, I, you, do you still have the original manual and everything? That's good. 
That's good. Not bad. Well, I'll let you uh, let you go. Well, there's the manual for that. Okay. I was talking about the manual for the truck. Nope. I have it somewhere. Uh, I know I had it. Yeah. Oh, you know what I did with it. I bet you I don't have it. <laughs> Not a big deal. When I bought this, it used to have a... Not this, it had a toolbox in there. Okay. That's yeah. where I kept it. Not bad. All right. I'm sorry, I forgot your na name again. What was Rob. it? Rob. Rob? Yep. Matthew. Matthew. All right. Well, I guess... I got it. a spare key there. Okay. Not bad. Just to get in, not to start it. Well, just to get That's in. That's smart. I have locked my keys in there. Yeah, oh, yeah. And I'm going... I ain't going to have to get in. Well, you know what I do for my grandpa's truck? Because I've locked myself out of this one. Plenty of times I hide it in the bed under the bed mat. Plenty of different places. Oh, yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. All right, well, it's nice, nice meeting you, and uh, I've got your number, so if uh, my friends are interested, they'll definitely call you in. I like good stuff. Oh, yeah, there's another new item, the radiator. Oh, wow, nice. This is really nice. Uh, I'm not, I can't say it's new now. It's been in there four years. Well, But yeah. it was new. Yeah, well. It still looks like it now. Not bad. Very good. Air conditioning good, or does it need recharged? It needs to be charged. I, uh, they replaced something on this for me. Okay. Uh, I think it was either the, the valve in that one or the yeah. valve up there, and it leaks. Does your, does your clutch work for the yep. air conditioner? Yeah, it all works. My air conditioner either. I don't think the clutch is bad, but I think my air conditioner needs to be recharged too, so. Yep. All right, well, I'll let you go, but, uh. It's nice stopping by, so now you know the history of this and your tours. Got brand new uh, tune up. <coughs> yeah, tune up. <coughs> Man, I lose my voice. <laughs> tune up on it. Okay, all new sparks, wires, new wires, caps, new. everything. That's great. Now, I have a Filter. question. That's all new. When you do a tune up, I did a tune up on my dad's Dakota, and it still seems to be gutless. 